carefully measured equal parts, followed by constant stirring. Once the epoxy turns clear, it's ready for use by resin artist Sherry Dassault. It's basically a two-part plastic is what it is, so you can embed things in there, it, not just flowers, anything you want to. I had one young lady send across the country a kitten's baby tooth, and she wanted that embedded in a necklace because she was smitten with that kitten. And I do a lot, of, um, a lot of custom work for people, for example, brides after the wedding, and they want to make a nice little keepsake out of the flowers from their bouquet, so I can do that, or uh, funeral flowers. It's just kind of a beautiful medium to show off the beauty of flowers. Jasmine Time is what she calls her resin art business, and though she does grow a lot of her own flowers, she also collects what others might not see the true beauty of. I literally walked around Shimanus collecting dandelion seeds because it's the Wish Necklace is one of my best sellers, which is the resin sphere embedded with dandelion seeds. But I got some seriously weird looks from some of the people in town when I'm collecting dandelion seeds. Sherry recently shipped 800 Wish Necklaces to Hollywood to be gifted to celebrities at the Golden Globe Awards. We'll get a list of the celebrities that were gifted and hopefully they'll tweet about it. So, kind of fun. Sherry's only been working in this medium for a couple of years, but she's always been creative. I've been designing my entire life. Um, I uh, had a store here in Chimines where I designed all the clothes and the jewelry for 25 years and closed it a couple of years ago to try something different. This feels like playing to me. It, it doesn't feel like work. Well, at Christmas when it got really, really busy and I have to get the orders out, that felt a bit like work, but uh, mostly it's, I just love being down here. Selling her work is a lot different than her experience of owning a shop. I wasn't aware of before when I had my store is this very cool place called Etsy. And Etsy is this huge online marketplace where anybody can open a shop as long as you're doing handcrafted goods. And then you can sell it to all over the world. So I had to learn the resin and then the photography and then uh, learning how to sell online. But I have to say Etsy makes it very, very easy. And so now I'm sold Oh, man, to Italy, to France, Australia, all over the world. Though she's thrilled with the online market, Sherry hopes to start selling more through shops and boutiques. You know, online is good, but people can only, see, it's pictures. And, you know, we all want to touch and see something so real life stores are actually, you know, the ideal situation. There are three boutiques in the interior of BC that carry Jasmine Time jewelry, but none currently on Vancouver Island something Sherry hopes to change soon. For Go on Shaw TV, I'm Kelly Robinson.